today we're gonna be going over all the Air Jordan releases set to drop this month in May. So let's go ahead and get started with the first shoe. And we have the dark royal blue Air Jordan 1 Low KO. Retail on these is gonna be $120. And I'm very in a, <laughs> I'm already looking at you, looking at me on the side. <laughs> what do you gotta say? $65 going once, going twice. Nobody bought them. <laughs> Come on. I'm interested. They to blew the shoe. Come on. They, they did too so, much to this. What's wrong with the, the shoe? The KO ones, the high top. It looked right? like they've been knocked out right. already. <laughs> like those already don't do as well. And then the low tops, like they try to bring the, you know, the, the energy around the union no. drop. But that didn't do good either. <laughs> no. So no. I, I think people are gonna be able to get these on sale. Is this on canvas? Is this like a yeah, canvas yeah, shoe? Yeah. So they blew it with that. I mean the, yeah, it's a pass for me. It's a pass for me. A pass? <laughs> no. <laughs> it shouldn't even be in a store. He said, come to a local dumpster <laughs> fire near you. <laughs> come on. <laughs> nah, right. if you ever never own no J's and you got your first pair, don't let it be those. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, don't try to get serious now. <laughs> All right. Okay, All right. so this is a women's drop. Uh, the Air Jordan 2 Cool Gray. But they got like a light blue element to the sneaker as well. I'm interested to see how this one goes because we got all this energy around the Jordan 2s and all the different stuff. But at the same time, there's a lot of good colorways that are sitting. We got classic Chicago's. But, but I think in the girls, I think they did good on this. It's a clean shoe. I think they did a very it's good a job on shoe. this. It's a clean shoe. The grays I told you before, they've been doing a really good job on the gray colors. Mm -hmm. um, for women, it's a great shoe. If anything, it should darken up some of the colors for it. But I mean, I'm colorblind, so who knows? <laughs> but so when it comes to this one, it says retail is gonna be 175 bucks, and I think that's too high. I think people are gonna be like, "I'll wait, get it on sale, still get the shoe." But it's a situation. women's shoe. You can't come out with a women's shoe right. for 175 dollars. And a Jordan Two. A Jordan Two. No. It's got to be like a that. hot collaboration for everybody to go crazy. Besides that, how do you feel it like 135? 135? That would be cool. But then that's like talking about 20 years ago type price. But I'm saying. Then women will buy it. Yeah. Women not gonna just rush out and spend 175 dollars for some. Not for those. No. Not for those. I think no. that's gonna be another one. catch them on sale. So it looks like May so far. You know, people are chilling, but there are some good releases. But this it's month. not. It's not the fault of the people. But that's it's good the though. The fault of the it's shoe. It's good for their pockets. It's good for their pockets. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take What is that? Don't we're even do even, that. We're not even gonna talk about this shoe. I was what, just, what was that? I was gonna skip over this. One. You should. That's three for three. <laughs> Air Jordan 37 low. Nothing but net. <laughs> Who? No, come <laughs> on. What is that coming out at? Eighty nine dollars? Uh, one hundred and seventy five. What are they tripping? <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll we'll just uh, we'll just. Okay, we're gonna leave go. that shoe alone. Right. Next up right here. I hope you show that shoe. In I'm, there. Gonna show it, I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it. All right. Next up right here, we have the Air Jordan One High OG White Cement. So you know, like on the Jordan Threes, you got right. the white cement print. Right. They put that on the Jordan One, and they did it kind of like all over the whole shoe. Not the whole shoe, but vast majority of the shoes. But the problem is they did too much. I think, well, okay, so the color blocking is actually like the Chicago color blocking. It's the same color blocking. I know. But, but the problem is because of the print, it looks like crazy, right? It looks like too much to me. I saw these in person the other day. Did they look all right? They're actually, I feel like they look better in person than they do Cause online. Cause right now I'm not feeling this shoe. 180 retail. They're crazy. I think that Again, if you brought it down to like maybe a buck fifty, right? Maybe you might be all right. That there's a fine line with buying the shoe at the right price. Yeah, and thirty dollars will kill the whole shoe. Yep. And right now, I don't see it. So Jordan ones have been sitting. Jordan fours are hot right now. Yeah. And that is everybody wants those, and it's kind of hard to get. You got to find good websites, different places like that. Which brings me to tell you guys about Poison because they have a great website and something that you guys definitely got to check out. So let me explain that to you guys real quick. Poison is a game changer when it comes to shopping online and they've been popping up more and more lately. So you know I had to give them a try. And I ain't gonna lie, they got some pretty good deals on their website. And don't worry, they pride themselves heavily on authentic products and fast and easy shipping. Even though this is a company that's based overseas, they still provide free shipping to us here in America. And 
that's something that I really love because I know that can be definitely very expensive, but to be able to factor that into your purchase and knowing that you can get free shipping, that makes things a lot easier when it comes to the checkout process. So when I was scrolling through the website, I had a hard time picking which shoe I wanted to purchase because they definitely had some good deals. And for me being a size 13, I actually found a lot of good options. And I'm definitely excited to show you guys what I got and I'm gonna have my dad unbox it this time. I picked up a pretty solid pair of shoes from their website and I am not mad at all. So I'll let you do your thing and we'll let him do the unboxing for you guys. <laughs> I, I ain't hey, used to this. Hey, be gentle too. Don't cut the top of the box. Oh, okay, okay. The shoe box on the inside. <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm scared now. <laughs> I never do this. My shoes are normally sitting on my high chair. <laughs> All right, what we got? Explain it to us. So this is great. Actually, great packaging. No, for I, real. Because I've seen stuff that come through and they've got the bubble wrap, everything. So they take care of it. They that bubble looks, wrap the top and the bottom of the box yeah, too. Yeah, so that, that's actually good. I really yeah, like that. Yeah. Okay. We got this. Oh, we got the shoe. I don't we don't even the got shoe. the shoe yet. We can't say that. We don't got the shoe. Well, yet. I don't know how you say it. What is this? Wait, first off, what size is this shoe? No, 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 no. It's my size. <laughs> okay, okay. I just wanted you to do the unboxing part. All right. No, they did good on that. Okay, okay they didn't turn nothing. Looks good. Whoa. <laughs> Wait a minute. I thought you didn't like these. What size is this shoe? <laughs> No! Is this a 14? Just for me, guys. Remember oh, earlier? a 13. Remember, ah! before, remember before he said, oh, I don't like that. Those no, ain't ranked that high. It, it's, it's a good looking shoe. Yeah, that's what I it's thought. It's a good looking shoe. That's what I thought. <laughs> but in hand, it looks hey, better. That's the thing, again, I said I love before. You can get these shoes and you can have those overseas websites and businesses that you can still get it for. You get free shipping. To still oh, that's dope. That's so dope. now you got the plug getting those different places. So for me, checking out this spot and being able to get something from there, I think it was a really good place to go to. Yeah. And I definitely will be getting a lot more shoes from here because I found some good deals on the site. But I just had to make sure it's I got these in particular. Shoe. Hey, you did good. I had to make sure I got these in particular just so I good. could have you unbox them so we could see what do you rate these no. out of 10? No, so look, it. I hated on these shoes a little bit. I did do that. But I'm gonna recant my statement. Now he's like, hey, is that a 14? No, it's <laughs> no, it's a good looking shoe. But I was just saying at first it seemed like it was too much. It's too far and this was too open. Yeah. You know? Yeah. But uh, no, it looks good. It looks good. Shout out to Poison, appreciate you guys. Now let's take it to the next shoe. We got a lot more to go over. Oh yeah, over. we gotta get back we, to we that. We still got like 10 more shoes to hit. Okay. Long as there's no more Jordan 37 lows, nothing but next. Do not do that. <laughs> Do not do that. Next up right here, we have a men's drop, the Air Jordan 2 Neutral Gray, and this is 185 bucks. Clean shoe, similar to that OG Chicago white red colorway. We've seen some other ones, Lucky Green, different ones. They just yeah. kind of switch up the gray and they could do the different colors on the shoe. And I, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Like I, think I was gonna say, I hated a little bit on that green on that. <laughs> I like this even on the more. the green ones, right. I like this more with the gray. I think it fills in real nice. It's a good looking shoe. The color think, blocking is great. Yeah, it's I easy. think that 185, that will still sell. But the problem is, they're not. These are gonna sit. What do you mean? These are gonna sit. I don't see these like just selling maybe out. Maybe because like I'm crazy. partial to the grays. Uh, maybe, but I think this is gonna be another one of those Jordan 2s. It sits. Be okay, let's take it back. Way back. Back into time. Nobody <laughs> bought the twos. Exactly. That's Nobody what I'm saying. That so let's think about it. The candy pack. When those came out, you don't, I don't know if you remember that, but remember no. like, this was like 09 or something like right. that. It was like a yellow colorway, a red colorway, a green colorway, a blue colorway, and it was like all over the same color. They had the white and gray ones, just like this. It had premium ass materials, you three remember everything. on there. It was not, cause I used to have them all. I know. <laughs> and they were super nice. I used to love wearing them. And it looked like these. And it was like the silver anniversary series and stuff. Great job. Nobody cared. Shoe didn't do well and all the different things. So I don't see this repeating and doing something different. I think it's gonna repeat and do the same thing it did in the past. I don't think so. I think people own the twos now. I think they've changed it. The, they've changed colors and everything and, and people have been on them. I've been seeing more people wear twos now. I like twos. We know that everybody like, well, I, I don't know if they all know, but we know I like twos, right? right? But the thing is the world and the masses of it, they just, it's an underrated shoe. It's a sleeper. Yeah. So because of that, you can get a great deal on that type of sneaker, maybe catch it at an outlet or get it for retail and not have to stress about it. So you think 185 so, might hurt them? They need to come to like, like They're gonna think about it and say, hey, maybe I should get something else. Maybe I should it's check out. It's close to 200. You know what I'm saying? So I don't know. Yeah. I think it's still a good shoe. Now these ones right here, these are actually really, really nice. 
this is the airship so they have the og like white and red airship i have those like up there and the, i don't know if you can see them you see the white oh, yeah, ones? Yeah, yeah, yeah. okay so like that's jordan's og airship shoe before the jordan one came out and that was the actual shoe that got banned and right, all these different things. right so now they're kind of like bringing that life back into the sneaker i think it's and you have something. this one right here coming out i don't know exactly i forgot what was on the back but when they do this shoe they do a1 materials they do so good when it right. comes to the sneaker so i don't know let me know what you think about these I think the shoe gun sit. I don't see nothing hype about it. I'm worried. 140 is good. So what if <clears> I, <throat> so I told knew you that? What if I told you that every single airship sells out? They're hard to get. They don't make that many pairs. Really? They're all expensive. I don't know. Maybe it's just hype. I don't know. I don't see the. Now you said okay. From the picture, I can't tell from materials. Right. But I will say this. I don't see the buildup on the shoe, like the combinations and the colors and everything else like right, that. I don't right, see right. that. And so to me, it looks pretty plain Jane. Mm -hmm. And so when you're going in it, but that's go ahead, keep talking. When you go into like 140, 150, you can kind of do one plain Jane, but you can't like on those twos, those twos have way more structure in that too. Feel the, feel the leather on those. Right. But this is a dad shoe, but it's a OG still. It's still an OG. The leather is very nice. Hella nice, right? <laughs> but that's what i'm saying so look at that and when you see that they come correct so when it this, comes to that back in the day the shoes did come out with this kind of leather they was really that's nice what i'm saying and you can tear this shoe up and the leather would still hold up that's the shoes very uh, is built very well so i get all that and but for 140 bucks they're one, gone. They're 140 is cool but i still say this look like uh you know the guy over 50 should be wearing these really but everybody rock the retro, the vintage, all the different stuff. No. No? No. I don't know. Okay, when y'all when this video drop, just tell me in one of the, in the comments if you're gonna rush out and get this or you're gonna wait to get this. Every I guarantee you because of hype alone, everybody's gonna rush. Not out. hype. Because of it. I'm telling you, it's just what it is. Nigel Sylvester has a collaboration. They got the different stuff going on. They're they're doing like it's a nice shoe. But I'm just, it's not enough for me. For me. All right, let's talk about a shoe that's not nice. And there's another, they're killing the game for the whole month right now. This is a, yeah, killing the game in all the wrong ways. <laughs> <laughs> Air Jordan Ball Women's Yellow Snake Skin. No. These are terrible. No, do not do that either. At 190? 190. Come on. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm a pass on those ones for sure. No. They're, they're, this must be the month they don't want to sell no shoes. Hey, you know, sometimes, you know, it's like this. There's good shoes this month. I promise you there's some good shoes. We just haven't hit them yet. <laughs> we're, just, we're just like halfway through the month. Wait till the tail end. It gets better. It gets better. In this shoe, I... <laughs> Jason Tatum won Barbershop. The Barbershop? <laughs> we're, we're good. We're, we're good. Okay, right there. Okay, Thunder finally. Board. We we're got good. one good Talk about pair those. of shoes. Talk about those that I really like. This is a great colorway. Looks like the materials is good. It can't go wrong in these. Right here, this is a great looking shoe. So these come out at the end of the month. How you got the shoe already? Don't worry about that. These are gonna come out at the end of the month. <laughs> See, in hand, this is a great looking shoe. Hey, it's nice. It can't go wrong. <sighs> so that's a cop for you. This is a cop for this sure. A cop for so you know what's crazy? The Thunder and Lightning Pack. Ooh. These was like a thousand dollars. They got up to like a thousand, twelve hundred, fifteen hundred dollars. Yeah. And the new era of sneakerheads coming in with the Jordan Fours are hyping up all the models. But it's wild because the prices don't reflect all the hype. Like right. these are going for 30, 40 bucks over retail right now. Right. And it, they haven't came out yet. Usually, like when it's like way before the release, what happens? Like it's like six hundred bucks. Yeah. Coming on five hundred bucks. Yeah. But it's crazy to see that sit and then the lightnings you can get them for a really good price and i tell everybody like this shoe said these in the lightnings they might be a little hard to get but at the same time even if you don't get them you can go to another place and still get them for a good price well i need a size 14 if y'all remember oh great <laughs> <laughs> let's take it to the next shoe 
Yo, for some reason, I didn't mention the Spider-Man ones. The movie's coming out soon, and you know they got some more Jordan ones that are coming out as well. Check out the colorway. I'm sure a lot of people have been talking about this sneaker. All the release information is going to be down below in the description when it comes to this shoe, and I'm looking forward to getting my hands on these. Let me know what you guys think about them down below in the comment section. I know I forgot to film this during the time when we were filming with my dad, but it's okay because we still got it here in the video, and I'll make sure that I get his opinion when we actually do the review video. So stay tuned for that because I know he's going to have some very interesting takes on it now let's get back to the video right here what you think <sighs> now we back to the same thing what that's the same thing as the red ones which ones the fire reds yeah the fire it's similar yeah but it's different because why is it different because it's lucky green <laughs> so <laughs> this is a women's release 200 bucks is the retail no so they did uh they did like the pine green fours it was a pine green i'm pretty sure it was pine green when it comes to the sb hold on i'll grab those one too just talk about that one i'll be right back i'm gonna say this most dudes well i ain't gonna bash women but a lot of dudes will buy girls they shoes and they're gonna spend 200 dollars on those i think there's some other shoes out there oh that's nice uh -huh. see this look at the difference in this shoe Okay, but look, though, but listen to me. Listen to me. Oh, listen to me. What? This, you gotta hold it up so they can see it. What? So these <laughs> are the fours. Right. Right? The SB4s, hyped up, top 10 shoe of the year, all the stuff. Leather on these is nice. These things are crazy. Yeah. But when you talk about affordable options, different things that look similar, all the different things, those look like these. It's the threes and the fours. Who gave you the blocking. information? Those don't look like these. How do they not? It's white, gray, green. It's the same shoe. No. Okay, here, 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 here. If you put this in a pack, if you put this in a pack and it was like a college series pack or something like that, yeah. you'd be like, oh, those go together perfect. They go together. That's what, but I'm, what saying. I'm saying. Look so at all the different details. If you can't afford this for five, six hundred dollars, you're gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna go get this one. For two hundred. So for the for the consumer, they're gonna see that and it's like, but, oh, it's another good affordable option. But when this come out, would it come out at uh two hundred? I forgot what the retail was. Yeah, something like that. Two twenty. So that's my point. So if it yeah. came out at two hundred, it was higher though. I think it was or two twenty five. Even two twenty five. Like I don't know. There's more detail. That it's a good looking shoe. It's a, it's a good looking shoe. I'm just saying. I'm just biased for women paying two hundred dollars for shoes. I can see they so small. You're right. <laughs> just less material. Right, like, bro. They taxing them. Right. <laughs> okay. All right. AJ one KO, bleached aqua. So remember we saw the low tops. Right. This is the high top. The actual like KO version. Uh, it's just, is this a, I think this is a men's drop, uh, 150 bucks. Canvas. I think, I think it's gonna sit. Canvas. You know? Like the Chicago OG colorway, they didn't sell that well. Like they kind of sold out-ish, kind of, you know what I'm saying? But they're not even hitting for that much now, still years down the line. So this one, outlets, easy cop. If you like it, grab it, no yeah. problem. But wait, I would say wait on the shoe just because... You probably can get it really easy. You're not gonna have no issues. You might go on sale. Or you no, like that. It's only, only like one, two wears. It's yeah, over. You're gonna mess it up. Okay, so this one is actually clean. The Air Jordan One Low OG <laughs> EX Coconut Milk. <laughs> no, but it looks like I can't tell by the materials on this one. But it looks like I can't tell. If it's That's a, a forty and over shoe. Sway. This is a clean shoe though. I just said it's a 40 and over shoe. And you know what I like? It has a black bottom. So it's, you don't have to worry that about it getting dirty and everything. When you drive like, in, everything all else. All different things. This is a clean shoe, 140 bucks, summertime. But it looked like canvas. I can't tell. That's not leather. I'm gonna try to find some other pictures online. That's not leather. But uh, yeah, what do you think about it? Don't do it. 140. No, I don't like it. What? I'm batting a thousand. Right now, I got one good pair of shoes and all these shoes coming out. I Garbage think, for the month. I think, same situation. Find a good deal, grab these for around a hundred bucks. At the outlets for 99. And it's a great shoe for the summertime. <laughs> you can't go wrong with it. If you're looking for an entry level sneakerhead type shoe, I think this is clean. I think this is a good shoe. It's not the best Air Jordan one ever. I'm not saying all that. I love how people always like to think of, oh, just because I said it's a clean shoe, I'm not saying it's the best no. shoe ever, but I'm just saying it's a clean shoe. It's cool. Like, I think that's a good entry. Like, if I see somebody rocking those, I'm like, them is clean. I think that that swish thing that they got up there at the top by the laces, that part right there, it might be removable. That right there? You know, they be doing all that extra stuff. Yeah, that's too much. They did too much. It, it was clean. If they left that alone, that'd be clean. Okay, what about this next one? Let me see. <laughs> see, what are they doing? <laughs> they, they figured if we just put Air Jordan 1 on any name, 
Then it's gonna sell. Any color on a Jordan One, huh? No, it doesn't do that. So we got the Jordan One High OG Craft right here. Uh, <laughs> no, okay. So one thing I can't say. Craft. One thing I can say is when they do these type of shoes, materials, production, everything is great, 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 great. But then what do they do? The colorway. That's where we mess they up. They blow it. So that that's always the issue right there. This one, I don't know if this is. I think yeah. So this is a men's drop. It's gonna be interesting to see who wants these. I'm gonna pass on these two. <laughs> I'm not a big fan of them. No, I'm, I just feel bad because what they're doing right now, on the last few of these shoes, they messed up the Jordan brand. In my eyes, is not everybody worst, else. Is this the worst month? This that is the ever worst done? month that we have ever done. And we've been looking at shoes for a long time in our life. <laughs> 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 I'm okay, just okay. Saying. These next ones is hard. These next ones is hard. That last pair is oh, the good atrocious. vibrations. Okay, these next ones is hard. Okay, we got I can Lady with High this. Air Jordan 14s. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so this was like a lower mid cut version, yeah. and then they brought it into the high top version. We never seen this before right. on the high top version. Right. So OG heads, they're like, yo, I need them. You know, this I already know high school colors for you. You're gonna be like, yo, right. I no, it's have a them. good colorway. Right. Like even the whole thing, like the sole, the bottom, everything looks good. Oh, question: Do you guys think I don't really like orange? But do you guys like blue and yellow or blue and orange better? I know he's gonna say blue and yellow. Of course, blue and yellow. I would say that too, but sometimes the blue and orange be sticking. It be hidden. It, it can, but no. We the blue and yellow it. is way better. We talked about it before. Blue and yellow. The gator stuff. Yeah. Ah! See? <laughs> See? That's how no, we can't use That's that right I'm now. Saying. We can't use okay. that. Okay. So Lanny 14s retails $210. For a women's shoe? No, this is a men's shoe. Oh, I was gonna but say. But the thing is, retail is 210 bucks. So you're gonna go up to like 400 No, not immediately. You don't think so? I think that I think the colorway is cool. I think I it's think good. it's cool, but like uh, I, I'm not I'm in time, it would do that. I could see that in time, but not immediately. But everybody don't rush for 14s. No, no. And then like that. all these new sneaker heads and everybody that follows the stuff on TikTok and what? the trends, like they're not gonna even bat an eye about these. And we're gonna be like, great, we can grab these. Right. But at the same time, we're gonna be like, damn, 210? Like, it's gonna be that kind of thing. So I think it's gonna be like, do you really want them? Do you want to have these in your collection type situation? Can you get a good Or you make them? a way and get right. them a little bit under? Yeah, and like, or, oh, I found a pair that was worn once. And yeah. Somebody sold them to me for 140 bucks or whatever. You know, like. Right. But, yeah, I don't know. I think it's a great shoe. I like these a lot. Yeah. Uh, out of the Jordan 14s, we don't see this this often with this color. Right. And to bring that back uh, in the high top version like they've been doing, I think it's super dope. There's a lot of amazing so. 14s. Like, yeah. whew, man, white UNC blue. Like, ooh, forest greens. The brown, white and browns. <laughs> oh, there was some. Oh, we need the 14s like, no, to come back. About it. <laughs> There's some good 14s. Have they over ever there. did an all red 14? Yeah, the Ferrari, oh. and it had the carbon fiber on the oh, bottom, yeah, yeah, and then they had the black. Yeah, 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 they did the, this version, yeah. but it had red on the back with the black toe. Right. right. Um, on that same thing. So, yeah. That's that's pretty much it though. Make sure you guys uh, tell them what you gotta say before we go. Oh, my Instagram is popping. Oh my god. Oh my god. Y'all need to hit my Instagram is popping. I don't know what the name is. Yeah, but... don't subscribe to my YouTube channel because <laughs> my YouTube is cracking too. No, I will just say this. Uh, be careful what you buy. Make sure you buy what you want to buy and spend your money how you want to spend it because. What we say for what we like for shoes and everything is just our opinion. Right. Make sure you spend your money the way you want to. Yep. Don't go off everything we say. Definitely. Sometimes you miss a deal just because I said I didn't like it. Yeah, don't listen to him <laughs> that much either, by the way. No. Uh, <laughs> but but I'm just saying, like, on some real stuff, like, we here to just give you all uh, our reviews and whatnot. But every time we come real of how we see the shoe. Yep. We not hype bees and... Nothing like that. Some people just hype everything right. up. We don't do that. Yeah. We don't like it. We don't like it. And then they be taking your troll. Like, you be trolling on the video. Like, oh, these are hot. And people be like, yo, dad think them is dope. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> It'd be funny. But yeah, I uh, appreciate you guys as always. I'll have all the links to his Instagram and YouTube hey, and everything. Minimum pop it now. I'm finally. Hey, you know what, though? I, I got to say this real quick. I'm BJ's dad. <laughs> Hey, and we gotta uh, we gotta let them know. We also post the behind the scenes stuff 
on his channel as well. So subscribe yeah. to his YouTube channel if you guys want to see any behind the scenes stuff. We'll show you guys some exclusive looks on the inside, everything, his perspective of things, right. his uh, his reviews on sneakers and his ratings. They're very yeah, interesting. Some of them is good. <laughs> All right, we gotta go. We, yeah. gotta, we gotta get out of here. Hey, remember, pick your poison. <laughs> <laughs> I would never let you down. Yo, before you go, I just launched my Sneakerhead Academy where we got everything on the inside. I teach you all the stuff that I learned over the past 15 years when it comes to sneakers, scaling, real estate, you name it. We talk about all of it in there. And there's an eight week program plus a bunch of monthly giveaways. I give away shoes literally way too much, honestly. But either way, I'll see you guys on the inside. Hit the link down below in my description or pinned in the comment section for DJ Sneakerhead Academy. And I'll see you guys over there. Hey, the only choice I like to make what I'm aware of. I would never let you down, it's in my DNA The only choice I like to make what I'm aware today I was made for it, it's in the DNA